Hi everyone, this is the tutorial for Nobody. My name's Billy from Piano and Pies. Let's get stuck straight in. So we're in standard tuning. I'm gonna go through the different chords and the different patterns, followed by the strumming and the structure afterwards. So the introduction does have a finger picking part. If you're not interested in learning the finger picking part and just want to learn the chords, uh, just we're gonna to get to there in a couple of minutes, so feel free to skip ahead. However, for the finger picking part at the beginning, we have one on the A string and three on the B string. And you're gonna play low, high, and low. And then take that shape, move it up one, two frets, and play those two together. It's technically part of a C major chord. So we have. Then move up a little bit more to five and six. So we've got. And you can see I started playing them together and then fill out the bar with extra notes. I then move my fingers up to fret 8 and 10. And I play that pattern, so we've got up to now. And then we have a Z row and a number 1 on the B string. Before going back to the original shape, that ends the pattern. So to play that solely, we get. And if you play through that three times, you get the introduction and the first verse. Now afterwards, when the full band properly kicks in, we get some chords where we're taking those shapes and strumming. We're gonna use a plectrum for this one. And the first chord we have is the trickiest chord of the lot, B flat major, which is one on the A string, three, three, three on the D, G, and B. So it's kind of like a bar chord, but you don't have to play the low E string. So that's the first chord we need. The second chord, C major, full C major chord, three on the A string, two on the D, an open G, one on the B, and an open E string. Uh, I'll go over all the chords before we get into the strumming and the rhythm, but we have D minor next, which is an open D string, two on the G, three on the B, one on the high E. The next chord we need is an F major chord, which is three on the D string, two on the G, one, one on the B and E. And then finally, the last chord we need, A minor. Open A string, two, two on the D and G, one on the B, and an open E string. Now, there's a lot of chords going on there. Thankfully, things just repeat for most of this song. So get used to those chords because we're gonna play really fast. And this is the rhythm that we need. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. So really full on. So we have that B major that we play. One, two, three, and four, and. So we're pushing these chords really early. B flat, two, three, C, D minor, three, four, F, two, three, A minor, B flat, two, three, A minor. So that's the order of the chords there. So it is pretty full on, but remember, this song repeats this a bunch of times. So if you do want to get a chord chart of all of the structure of all the chords in every order, as well as a PDF of the chords and the lyrics matched up, head on over to Patreon. There is a link to that in the description. And just for a couple of dollars, you get everything wrote out professionally, saves you from writing it out and potentially making a mistake. So feel free to consider that. However, let's talk about the structure. Now that we've learned the chords, we've learned the strumming, what happens is when you get to the chorus and the pre-chorus, you play through that pattern twice for the pre-chorus, twice for the chorus. We then get a second verse where you can go back to the, go back to that pattern. We then have another pre-chorus and chorus. So basically everything just repeats itself. However, we then get a bridge which introduces another new chord. However, to begin with, it's thankfully largely the same. So we have B flat major, one, two, three, D minor, and then F, followed by G minor. Now the best way to play this is a bar chord, so uh, if you're confident with your bar chords, then this one's for you. Three on the E string, five, five on the A and D strings, and then three, which is the bad finger, remaining on uh, the last few strings. So that bridge loops around twice. I'm gonna play through just once where we sustain the chords. 
B flat two three and D minor F G minor two three four do that twice and you've got yourself the bridge after that we have another chorus which is two times round same as before and that'll get you to the end of the song so if you found that in any way useful, please like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel to grow and hopefully make this a bit more of a full-time job. So thanks to you for watching and thanks to the people on the screen. Those are my active patrons. They are the ones that help me get through all the editing of this silly face uh, by supporting me every month. And they'll get the content that I made, which is the chord chart and the PDF of the chords and the lyrics matched up. They'll get that straight away the moment this video goes live. So thanks to them and thanks to you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.